Breaking news happening this morning. A SWAT standoff in South L.A. just ended after a man fired a gun at his neighbors. CBS News' Candace Crone is live for us at 97th near Normandy. Candace? Yeah, witnesses say they heard several shots being fired by a man who lives at this apartment building. Well, he and another woman who was inside at the time were taken to the police station after a six hour standoff. We have some video of deputies bringing that woman out in handcuffs. So they were called here for a family disturbance around 11 o'clock last night. When officers got here, they say a man and a woman were arguing. She left. And then at some point, that man exchanged words with his neighbors. Well, deputies say he went back inside, got a gun, and then fired shots at them. Uh, uh, they were not injured, and then he went back inside. Well, crisis negotiators tried to call the man, but a woman who was in the apartment hung up on officers, and eventually deputies had to fire tear gas to get both of them to come out. A witness, as I spoke with, uh, described the chaos. I just really heard a lot of arguing, and I couldn't really too much, make too much sense out of it. But uh, then I heard some gunshots, and then the next thing I know, the police was coming. I seen two men fighting. It was fighting, and I seen the blood, and I ran back in the house, and I came back out again, and I seen a gun. And that's all I remember who had the gun. It was shooting, shooting. And those neighbors told me that there has been an incident with this man in the past that deputies have been called out to deal with him about a year ago. They say they are just fed up with the violence in this area. We're live in South L.A., Candace Crone, CBS 2 News.